hey guys welcome back to my channel if you're new to this channel you're welcome and if you're a returning subscriber hi thank you so much for watching my videos and on today's video i'll be showing you how to make these sweet balls you can call them dumpling you can call them kaimati so without further ado let's get to the video so i'll start by measuring 400 grams of flour and then after that i will add 70 grams of sugar Mix everything, and then I will add some yeast. And then after that, I will add some cardamom, just to give you some nice flavor in your mouth. And the smell, mmm. Then now I'll be adding some lukewarm water. So actually this water, I boiled it with uh, some cardamom. And this is just to give that smell. So you boil the water, you let it rest for some time and then you can use it. It shouldn't be so cold, it shouldn't be so hot. It should be in between. <laughs> As you can see our mixture is done so all we have to do is to let it rest so we'll cover it and put it in a warm place for at least an hour And one hour later, our mixture has doubled in size. So now I'm going to boil the oil because it's really important that you boil your oil before you start cooking your mandazi or your sweet bowls of joy. Make sure that the oil is really hot. And now I'll start to cut the portions. So I use some oil. This helps me to cut the, the balls into nice shape. And I'm using my hands actually, my fingers, the tips of my fingers. It's because it helps me with portioning. Some people use spoons, some people use um, how do you call the ice cream uh, scoop it's up to you it's your choice but i really enjoy using my own hands because i know the portions you can make them smaller you can make them bigger it's your choice When you're done with that, now you have to turn the, the mandazi or the sweet balls. You have to turn them regularly. This is to make, sh make sure that they're well cooked and the color is taking in both sides. So make sure you turn them every time.
and when you're happy with the color now you can put them aside so you can continue to cook the rest So if you guys are really interested in cooking videos and whatsoever, anything about kitchen, I'll put the link up here. So if you really want to see them, please go and check them. so guys i hope you really did enjoy this video if you did please don't forget to like this video please don't forget to share this video with your family and friends and also leave me a comment down below and another thing if you haven't subscribed in this channel please subscribe it's free of charge actually just for a reminder and we will see each other in the next one bye